I'm sorry about that. No, you don't. <laughs> if you keep on frowning like that, you'll get wrinkles, you know. Oh. Besides, we know your hands are tied. I wish you'd said something to us. At least then we might have been more useful. That's true. <laughs> Listen to him, getting his sulk on. It's only because he looks up to you so much. You did the right thing, you know. The marionette is still out there on the loose after murdering the professor. Ideally, it's something we shouldn't even have to hide from the residents. Anyway, you did well, Hal. I'm impressed. It's hard to believe this is your first case. Hey, miss! I work my socks off, too! How about a little compliment for me? Well, she's right. Lily, it's too soon to celebrate. We still haven't solved the case, after all. The professor's murderer <laughs> is hiding somewhere here in the city. We could have another murder on our hands, if the marionette feels like it. Looks like the lockdown will have to continue for the time being. Look, what I don't get is, why did that guy try and cover up the professor's death? There's definitely something fishy going on. Do they have some kind of connection? Director General, do you mind if I duck out early? I'm feeling kind of exhausted. It's not true, you're going to Keith. Same old Ash. I suppose it won't hurt. Go on, I'll send you the classified file later. Nice heels, bro. You did good today, Hal. The investigation is important. But make sure you keep an eye on how the city is doing, okay? <laughs> I actually did. <laughs> the whole day. <laughs> Counseling is a vital part of any supervisor's role. Go on, Hal. You should head home too. We jumped seven percent for some reason. I guess maybe with the reconstruction, some more stuff appeared. But then again, why is the case still ongoing? Maybe it's gonna be hundred percent eventually. Now I'm just gonna be hanging around in AD every once in a while because I can't handle. Another cleaning up thing. What are you doing here, Elaine? How? The fact that the marionette is out there somewhere is a real concern. That's it? Ah, happy place yet again. We did like every hitting now, so I guess my job is easier. <laughs> I'm also not sure if they appear over time or like after certain events. I wonder what happened in the memory room though. There is no split, it's just a straight road. For once. <laughs> Wait. What the hell? What the? Something's wrong. This wasn't here this morning. Ah. <laughs> uh. I'm scared. Help, this way. Yeah, but I need to defend myself first. <laughs> Maya? Why? Because I'll be <laughs> a culprit or something. Someone's in there. Huh? 
Freeze! Step away from Maya. Ahem. <clears throat> Give me my hand first. <laughs> but first, just keep holding my hands like this for a moment. Don't you recognize me? Wait. Help me. What? <laughs> on <laughs> thumbnail Lily That's what's going on. I think Maya is inside the marionette. How? That's crazy! Look, Maya is right here! I mean, that would make sense in the grand scheme of things. You saw too, right? Their movements, they were just like Maya's. What to do now? I mean, it's like there was a fight or something. Memories in it. I, I want to solve this on my own before anyone else gets involved. I'll keep this knife hidden somewhere safe. <laughs> like what? Personality construct. As the one that we got. Okay, it's kinda hard to understand still. But isn't Maya inside it right now? Bye. 
back here. decided long, long ago. <gasps> Why that dream again? They said the city would fall. Why? Because the professor died? Hal? What's wrong? I don't know. I just have this bad feeling. Let's head to the clock tower. Why? Why we left her down there? <laughs> All clear, nothing to report. Yeah. The city seems calm. Duh. Wait, what? How? Uh, since when did you? The thing is that uh, she has a bounty. <laughs> Anyone will shot her on sight. Are you Maya? Hmm. Yeah, you've gotten taller. Maya, you shouldn't be outside right now. <laughs> How did you figure out it was me so quickly? Unless this personality iOS is like shifting between two things. Even I'm not sure who I am sometimes. Maya. I haven't felt right since I woke up. Do you think? The professor had some kind of plan for the city, or maybe whoever killed him was planning something. Well, that, and we got the info that Ash knew about Keith's arrival, and just there are other stuff happening. I don't know. The only thing I'm sure about is the fact that if we don't stop it happening. Wait, I know this voice actor <laughs> from Aldeus. There's definitely a way. Can you predict the future? at home. That's not happening. Shocker. Hell. Maya, this way. 
No move. Uh-uh. What, what about Ash and stuff? change the past anyways. Wait, no, 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 hey! We can't change the course of actions. Go back. How you have to get home right now. Maya, she's... Oh, wow. How? Where were you? Maya, she's... How? Don't kill me now! You have to help her. No, no, no. I need to rewind time. I need to go back. Yeah, I imagine this is gonna be the case. What? Okay, so, episode 2 in December. Cool, but I still want to see if I can actually change the course of the events. Oh wait, there's no even menu, like, just go to the title? Let me see just really quick. Okay. Uh, yes, yes, yes. But what about revisit memories? We just walk around here. Uh huh, okay. So there is nothing different. It's like a precursor for the next episode. Oh, now I get it. That's what it is. After those big gates in the hall. The clock tower. <laughs> okay. Here are my thoughts on the episode 1, cause we'll surely do the other ones, it's just it was split for some reason this time around. Love the jump in terms of locomotion, performance, graphics, storyline, just pretty much everything makes sense. The thing is that from what I remember, Tokyo Chronos and Aldeus, every small change would alter the future. This, I guess because it was split, we can't really decide the endings or just anything else because we won't progress further into the storyline so it's not like we're ending with a bad ending or something like that it's just the game just won't progress further on so that spirit of the series kind of went downhill there are some clunkiness in terms of just time travel and what have actually happened and like just the game gets confusing not in terms of the storyline but just the features sometimes make no sense and stuff appear or disappear between the scenes my concern further on have that's gonna evolve in episode 2 and 3 because i don't see it happening just like in the previous game having 10 plus endings possible to discover because of the nature of the episodes we'll see how that's gonna go kudos for making something fresh on the store though time travel is not an easy thing both from storytelling and designing perspective so the fact that this works almost perfectly is a feat of itself see you in the next episode